Welcome, welcome, welcome. What's going on, everybody? Listen, man, I was just checking my emails and my uh, YouTube channel, man. I love YouTube, man. Hey, if y'all not subscribed, go subscribe for me. But anyway, one of the questions I had on a particular video, uh, this young lady, first of all, y'all understand me. There's no such thing as a dumb question or a simple question. Now, her question was, my cigarette lighter power outlet don't work. Again, to me, there's no such thing as a simple question. So I figure I can shoot a quick video faster than I can type all this stuff down to answer a question. So here we go real quick. We're going to talk about the cigarette lighter and the power outlets on this minivan. Now, this minivan happened to be a 09, but from 08 through 10, the same applies. Okay? On up applies too, but the, uh, the tip them and the uh, power outlet box is different. So we're going to focus on between 08 and 10. The power outlets and the cigarette lighter. We're going to talk about that when I get back. Okay, welcome back, man. Welcome back, man. Listen, man. First of all, uh, this car has a total of four power outlets. Actually, three. One being a cigarette lighter. Now, you got a cigarette lighter outlet and a power outlet inside the instrument cluster at the bottom bottom of the instrument cluster. You also have a power outlet in the center console. The center console where your arm lay on uh, up inside. You slide that tray back and there's an outlet right there. There's also an outlet behind the left side captain chair of this van. There's a power outlet back there. Now you also got a, a, a high bolt a power outlet, a home source back there, but we'll talk about that on another video. Now these uh, power outlets and cigarette lighter are protected by 20 amp Fuses. Okay, I'm gonna show you exactly where they're located. At. They're located inside a module. Some people still may call it a fuse box, but it's not a fuse box. It just happened to house fuses. This is a TIPM. TIPM stands for Totally Integrated Power Module. This is where most of your relays, most of your fuses, most of your uh, drivers are located now in this TIPM. Okay, and uh, the fuse that feeds your uh, power outlet in the rear happens to be uh, M7 fuse. Like I say, that's the 20 amp fuse. It's inside of your tip of them. All you do is uh, pull the fuse out, see if it's blown. If it's blown, there's a reason why it's blown. They don't, they don't just blow for nothing. Maybe you stuck your cell phone in wrong, or maybe you stuck something in there wrong. Maybe a kid stuck a penny in there or something. At any rate, it popped the fuse. So if you replace the fuse, uh, do it with caution because like I say, a fuse don't just pop for nothing. Um, now, the fuse that protect your center console, that's right here in this slot right here. So you also got another fuse that protect your, uh, the outlet in your center console and your cigarette lighter. That's the fuse right here. So better yet, just check all three fuses, man. You want to keep it simple and make sure all of them good. All right, there you have it, man. Thanks for watching, man. That's a simple video on your power outlets and your cigarette lighter elements. If your outlets don't work, this is probably why, man. It's probably some simple like a fuse, but I just wanted to make this video to show you where the fuse is at because sometimes it can be hard to find a particular fuse. But again, all these fuses are housed inside the tip of it. Totally integrated power module. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Any more simple or any question you have, put it at the bottom. Uh, anything you want me to talk about, put it at the bottom. Because uh, let's keep in mind, I'm a dealer tech and I happen to know everything about the minivan. All right. Uh, th again, thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next video.